Regeneration of nerve fiber. In this topic, we are going to be dealing with the criteria for regeneration and the stages of regeneration. The term regeneration refers to regrowth of lost or destroyed part of a tissue. The injured and degenerated nerve fiber can regenerate. It starts as early as fourth day after injury, but becomes more effective only after 30 days and is completed in about 80 days. Criteria for regeneration Regeneration is possible only if certain criteria are fulfilled by the degenerated nerve fiber. The criteria are as follows. Gap between the cut ends of the nerve should not exceed 3 mm. Neurolemma should be present. As neurolemma is absent in CNS, the regeneration of nerve does not occur in the CNS. Nucleus must be intact. If it is extruded from the nerve cell body, the nerve is atrophied and the regeneration does not occur. Two cut ends should remain in the same line. Regeneration does not occur if any one end is moved away. Stages of regeneration First, some pseudopodia-like extensions grow from the proximal cut end of the nerve. These extensions are called fibrils or regenerative sprouts. The number of fibrils is up to 100. Fibrils move towards the distal cut end of the nerve fiber. Some of the fibrils enter the neurolemma tube of distal end and form axis cylinder. Some of the fibrils enter the neurolemmal tube of distal end and form axis cylinder. Schwann cells line up in the neurolemmal tube and actually guide the fibrils into the tube. Schwann cells also synthesize nerve growth factors which attract the fibrils from proximal segment. Axis cylinder is fully established inside the neurolemmal tube. These processes are completed in about three months after injury. Myelin sheath is formed by Schwann cells slowly. Myelination is completed in one year. Diameter of the nerve fiber gradually increases. However, the degenerated nerve fiber obtains only 80% of original diameter. Newly formed internodes are also shorter than the original ones. In the nerve cell body, first the nissel granules appear, followed by Golgi apparatus. Cell loses the excess fluid, the nucleus occupies the central portion. Though anatomical regeneration occurs in the nerve, functional recovery occurs after a long period. 